it's been around for a while, but I think it is. It's people don't like change and um, yeah, it's just the rules of the road and they just don't get it or don't want to do it. Merging is something every driver must do when they're getting on the interstate. But some drivers feel there's an issue here in the FM area. Good evening. Thank you for joining us tonight. One person reached out to our whistleblower hotline asking why drivers seem to have an issue merging on the 8th Street I-94 westbound ramp in Moorhead. And whether or not the new 8th Street construction in Moorhead will make merging easier. Valley News Team's Ashley Bishop investigates. And they're kind of used to taking those back country roads and not used to really driving on city roads. So when they have to kind of learn how to merge, they just really don't know how to do it and they're too afraid. A few can. I think the majority are pretty bad at it, though. We sat over at the 8th Street I-94 westbound entrance and watched traffic merge over a course of 30 minutes on Friday morning during the rush hour commute. Some drivers merged perfectly fine, while some southbound drivers just sat at the merge point waiting. It can get kind of frustrating um, in the morning when you're merging on to 94 with the merge sign right there. And of course, some people just stop. Schmidt says it can be dangerous. Do people know how to merge? No. <laughs> no, they don't. Uh, the, you know, the worst part about it is they merge with their foot on the brake and sit on the gas. Truck drivers like Sam Hart drive all over the country and merge multiple times a day. He says people need to blend into traffic. He has seen numerous accidents from people trying to merge. But when they don't get on the gas and they can't get out of the way, and then we're all bottled up. Minnesota Department of Transportation traffic engineer says the A Street and I-94 merge point is less than an issue than it was just three years ago, adding that it's not a zipper merge, which is common in construction areas, and allow both lanes to alternate. The merge point is a spot where drivers need to be courteous and allow drivers to enter. We're aggressive drivers these days, that's for sure. Part of the society now, they don't want to wait for anything. I mean, you know, we got to have it now, which means I got to be at home in 15 minutes instead of 15 minutes and 45 seconds. In Moorhead, Ashley Bishop, Valley News Live. The Minnesota DOT says the merge area on 8th Street will remain the same even after the reconstruction project this summer. But there will be a larger space and a longer gap of time for drivers to merge. And if you need help uncovering fraud and corruption in your community, call our whistleblower hotline at 701-237-6576 and leave your tip. A member of our investigative team will get on the case and go to work to expose the truth.